Welcome back everyone to Procrastination Spaghetti Junction City here in Satisfactory. Now you remember from last time we did a lot of procrastinating, doing setting up more power and all that. Yeah. Technically I was procrastinating, but it's all going to be very useful for the future. Having batteries is going to be awesome. Doubling out my coal power output is awesome. These were all things that really needed to be done. Yes, I was procrastinating, but I was also doing important jobs that are going to save me a lot of time later. So, I can't say that. And have some sort of a straight face, still. But I need more copper wire production up and running. Get over here, and I think I have the resources now to upgrade this. What is it? Miner Mark II. I didn't even bring the mining thing. Oh, because I spent it. That was I spent it on the coal, didn't I? Uh, I'm a dance. I'm a dance. Let's go get it. Navigating Spaghetti Junction can sometimes be complicated, but running on your conveyor belts speeds you up rather nicely. Helps if you're in the right direction. I need to go this way. I don't have a conveyor belt going quite the right way. That'll help a tiny bit. Do it. Lovely. What was that I needed again? Ah, yes, it wasn't this I needed, it was this. I'm gonna build a couple of them because they're always I'm always needing them. There we go, that'll do it. Let's head back. More power sorted. I'm so glad we got that power done. As I was saying at the beginning, it was it was me procrastinating setting it up, but it's just seen our power was getting rather close to being maxed out and we needed it done, so. Oh no, oh, don't fall. Is this already conveyor belt mark 3? No, I'm gonna have to upgrade it then. That was if we push the right button. Then conveyor belt mark 3. Miner Mark 2, which now means we're getting 120 a minute, lovely, which means I could put another splitter on here, so get another splitter, why can't I not put a splitter on there? Can't afford because I don't have any goddamn copper wire. Ah! Uh, I'm gonna go old walking over this goddamn conveyor belt bridge. I'm starting to think I should build. You know what? You know what I'm gonna do? Because I'm doing this all the goddamn time, this trip. Hypertube entrance. Power. Probably some spare power somewhere. Come on, I normally like to leave spare ones around. Oh wait, I just realised I'm not going to be able to anyway because I don't have the copper wire. <laughs> I'm just about to start setting up power stuff and I don't even have the copper wire. Ow. So I'll set it up on the way back. 
Just so I don't have to make this trip every god. Well, I'll still have to make the trip a lot, but it's. Should be enough. Get entrance. A power somewhere. There we go. Gonna put that in a bare spot, but oh well. Oh, I put it there. Okay, that's a wee bit inverted from what I was wanting, but. I can live with that, I can live with that. I could argue this is me procrastinating again, but I don't feel like I'm procrastinating at the moment because this is all linked to what I'm actually trying to do. And our thingy, I don't really need you anymore if I'm going to be using the hypertubes to get up there, do I? I just realised I'm a dunce because I can't connect it now. I should use that one last time then. <sighs> if it doesn't have an entrance, can I still travel on it? Did I just fall out the end? I think that's how it works. I can use this to get up there. Are they flying fish? No, they're birds. They are actually birds, right. Yeah, this trip. This is actually a longer trip than I realized. It's taking the hyper tubes this long to get here. Ooh, right, lovely stuff. Seriously? I know. And then, uh, entrance. There. I did this. Power. What well, if I had a spare one down there? It used to be connected to the. There it is. Right, now. I thought I was going to fall down the waterfall there. I was seriously going to be peeved. Now we need another... Splitter here. And another... Fair belt three going into here. Then I can have two. Actually, that should be splitting it into two sixes, right? So conveyor belt one would have been fine. Yeah, that's split into two sixes. So one would have been fine, but oh well, I've got threes. Doesn't really matter. Where am I going to take these outputs? I'm going to need to figure out where I want the factories. I 
think I've got room over that way, so let's get... These are coming out, plus these will be shortcuts back to my... Transportation here. Could even maybe... I've got no fuel in it. How's it working if I've got no fuel? Even maybe try and squeeze the two smelters here. Smelter. One. Two. Brilliant, they fit. That's two ferry outputs. Copper ingots. Copper ingots. Now, 15 so that's going to be enough to support four copper wire factories, but I want four copper wire factories. I don't know. I'm using a lot of these cables actually, so setting up a lot of cable production could be useful because I'm going through it like there's no tomorrow. Having surplus wouldn't be a bad thing. So let's uh, not go into that miner. Come down here. Set up structures. Oh no, I'm running into those plates. Has that got anything on it? It does actually. Hit it in the way, which is annoying. Two, three. Wish I could stick one on top. I could stick one. Just the front there. Yeah, I was gonna say, is it not gonna build it? There it is. One, two. Lines nearby them. Make sure I've always got plenty right now. Perfect. So let's see. You're going to come out of here. Come down to here. Be back up though. I need back up. Yeah, let me up. Look at that. Just going through the ground. I don't even care. It's forgetting junction. Deal with it. <laughs> You're gonna come through here. And I'm gonna need a splitter. Yeah. Splitter. Yeah. You are gonna go into this splitter. You are gonna go into this splitter. You are gonna go into. This splitter, uh, dump that one down there. Oh no! Roaching others' clearance. Oh no, wait, 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 you can get there. That gets you past one. How do I get you past this other power? Can't afford. Oh, that's what's going wrong now. We need a uh, concrete. Pretty sure I've got surplus off somewhere around here. I just steal it from you. We you know you're making the concrete. Uh oh. Am I using one hundred percent of the concrete? I hope not. I'm not storing it anyway, that's for sure. I'm not. I 
I have a hundred in there. Unless it wasn't working at 100%, then I might be needing 100% of the concrete. Or well, just not yet, because it's not working at 100% for some reason. But I thought we had it fine tuned and not tuned and all that lovely stuff. But apparently, maybe not. So I'm rambling now for the sake of rambling. That kind of looks like it's sitting on top of the pole. That's kind of cool. Maybe it even is. Right. Too steep, right. That needs to go too. Others clearance. What the? <laughs> I can get it over here. I can get it. You know what? Let's get you. Get it to turn. There, like that. There, brilliant. Then I can get it. Smelter, what am I doing? The wrong thing, that's what I'm doing. I'm nearly out of these plates. I should have picked up more when I was back at my base earlier, but I didn't because I'm a scrub. Right. Wire. You know what? That that's fine. They're like that. That you to wire. That you to wire. That you to wire. Build some more factories. Vastly running out of space pretty fast. How much? Let's get the structor, just dunk it down here just so I can take a look. Cable, 60 wire to 30 cable. Right, so... These are each 40, aren't they? No, they're 30 each. If I just combine two of them, I can get two lots of cable production. Right, so let's get that. On the go. I might need to replace, move that actually at some point, or unless I combine it. Murder son, but we need more. Can't add like junctions on these, can you? I was gonna say maybe like a junction. Just pop a junction on here. And attempted to build a third one going over there now just to speed things up a wee bit more. Back in here. Kinda feels like it's not worthwhile to set up, but once it's set up it it's not that it's not worthwhile to set up, it kind of feels like it's more procrastination time to set up like another travel one going over to the other side of that other factory there. But once it's set up will be really efficient time wise. I'm trying to stretch my knee because it feels a wee bit weird the way I've been sitting. What that noise was. Okay, I've got a pillow all the way there and I'm like, alright, instead of sitting my leg under the desk, just have it rest a little bit. Oh, right. Just up here. 
Let's find again. Here we go. Yeah. Grab that. Actually, you know what? Wait, wait, wait. Oh, wait, no, no, yeah, let's grab that. I was going to say, I can just start this biofuel just in case it ever. Yeah, there we go. Need it, but yeah. The wood in there, too. Yeah, I'm just going to leave the woods. Leave the woods. Back we go. Easily got plenty of that stuff. Plates. Not time to start speeding up. And faster! And faster! I should I said I might have made a massive mistake. Oh good. I thought maybe that's gonna fire me out straight into that one. Did not though. These two guys' output, a merger. You are going to be making a cable. Just don't fight Deadpool. You're meant to be his friend. You're already on cable. I need to connect it to power. I built some spare ones down here just for this situation. Do the inputs first. We'll do the inputs first. There's the input. There's another input. There's now and that plant. We're going to the other factory here. That didn't go in it, right? Yep, that did. Lovely. Why can we not? Oh, I built the container the wrong way around, didn't I? I want the input to be this side. That'll do. Cables are coming out. Why is there no cables coming out of you? You're not getting any copper input yet. You should be. Why are none of these getting their... They're not getting their copper ingots yet. Ah! That explains a lot. Followed it back, found the missing link in the chain. Oh, that should solve that. Combining that, and that was a 60 copper wire a minute we're now making. 
Where is the factory? Oh, we haven't built the factory. Oh, we did build the factory, didn't we? It needs to come all the way over. All the way through the spaghetti junction, making it even more of a spaghetti junction. And it needs 60 a minute. How much are we actually going to need? 50 a minute! That leaves me 10 cables spare from our production. Brilliant. Why are we not getting stairs yet? Wait a minute. These are stairs, right? Stairs. Inputs coming on over. Why are they not... Why is it not taking any in? Does it need power to take them in? I'll have some spare somewhere. Oh, I've always got spare power things. I'll put them everywhere, but I can never goddamn find them. Or one there, but I never normally leave them empty. Where are they all? I always leave at least one empty. Just always try to. There we go. Another one there. Put another one there. Just so. Now it's taking them in. Okay, so it does need power to even take them in. Right. Lovely. Cables coming out. I'll just get a wee bit of surplus cables there. So we got 60 a minute coming down here. On this very up and down conveyor belt. Meow. And we're finally going to have our automatic wiring production started. Brilliant. Twenty-five a minute, and I think we need about five hundred to get the next thing done. Right. Now we just need the last one. These. Okay, so we're gonna have to set up a whole new of those frames, or steal some steel back, or take some steel back. I think it'd probably be easier to set up new frame production here, which they need reinforced iron plates. Let's go to these ones. Oh, wait, I might have some spare screws. Hmm. Hmm. Whirl my little tiny moustache as I contemplate how we're going to do this. I've already got a good modular frame production back at the oldie basey. Do I want to just take some steel frames, start transporting them back and building it back there? That's a lot of conveyor belt to put down. And I did remember someone mentioning that one of their first games they conveyor belted everything. Their conveyor belts going all the way across the map and eventually it did cause frames to just go So... I'm not going to be able to do that often because it was a nice heads up because I hadn't even considered how much the frames will eventually start tanking if you've got an awful lot of conveyor belts. I kind of want to. I kind of want to. So 24 seconds. So we're going to need roughly 30. Just est of guess. No. I'm just estimating, I'm not working it out, but 20 seconds, we're going to need roughly 30 a minute spare. Wait a minute. Right here, we're getting the same, we're using 24 a minute here. Where's my steel beam production? How much spare do we have? I've got two factories that should be working at 100%. Why is it only working at 69%? 30. Oh no! What I may do is I may. S what 
Why are these not working at 100%? 69%. This coal, I fine tuned it perfectly. Why? Where have I gone wrong? I've gone wrong somewhere in my coal fine tuning. Let's take a look, see. Where have I gone wrong? It should be 15 into each of these. Right, no, 45 into each of these. 45, 45, 45, 45. There's 90, 180. We should have 180 coal coming down, being split down twice, right? Let's see how I've done here. So 120 coming out of here. Being split into two 60s. That's going down there to them. And this is coming over here. This is 60 coming out of here and going into here. Okay, so what's coming out of these two? I'm guessing they're going to be 260s as well. Yep, again, 260s. Delt Mark 2. Delt Mark 2 does have 120 seconds, right? Just not check. Wait a second. Yep, perfect. That's two sixties. So this is three sixties. So this is hundred and eighty now coming out of here. That's where our problem is. L mark three. Because that's only hundred and twenty. It's hundred and eighty coming out, but only effectively. You know what I'm saying? It's back on, so it's not there. That's coming into here. These, yeah, so that was only a Mark II and it needed to be a Mark III. That's 180 going in, 180 coming out. That's a two 90s coming out, split into 245s, and let me guess, one splitter split into 245s. There we go, we found the problem and we fixed it. It was all that one little tiny bit there was a tier 2 conveyor belt, which I'm surprised that I built a tier 2 conveyor belt there because I've been very reluctantly using tier 2s. I've just been using tier 3s instead because it's easier for me to get the tier 3 resource because I've got a more bigger surplus of that. So it doesn't, it feels more expensive to build the tier 2 one than it does the tier 3 one the way I've built my factories. So that should get these up to 100%. It won't be straight away, but it should go up to 100%. See, it's already nearly 100%. But it should then have the knock-on effect and it'll get everything here working 100% and that should fine-tune everything much more nicely. So I'm glad we caught that, that was perfect. But... I'm going to need more steel production. I think what I'm going to do is I think I'm going to set up steel production, a whole new steel production area, back close to my first base. Because I know where there's some steel that's not too far away but it is quite a bit far well far away with some coal and some iron where i built my power in my offline game that i'm slightly behind this in if i go there and build some steel production there and then transport it over to my main base actually because i'm all cold out here aren't i we're maxed out on coal i'm at tier two on both those coals. Though I do have that coal there, I could set up some more coal production here. But to have spare... Is to have spare iron though to make the steel? That's the question. Yeah, I can get another 60. Which would support... It wouldn't support enough here. I need... A, I need like an hour 180. And I can only get one more. I can only get 60 more. I can only get a third... Wait, no, I don't need an hour 180. I need to support two of these. So I need 90. I can only get 60 more. Budge! Budget! That can't get miners free yet, can I? Nope, I cannot. I could go get a power slug. And get the power thing. How much efficiency does that give? The miner gives this one here. I put that into one of the miners. I could get the... It's spitting out. How much does a tier 1 power slug increase it? We could build it here. If I upgrade that to a tier 2 and increase its efficiency, like how much would I, that would get to 120? I'd need it to be a 50% efficiency buff. 
We're at a part now, so I don't have time to go check how much a power slug efficiency buff is. But if I can get to a 50% power slug efficiency buff, I don't think I can, though. I think it's only like 10%. Off the top of my head, I can't remember. But if we can get the 50%, I think we'll do that here. We'll set it up here, because it's closer. We can get this all in the one area. If not, we'll go back to our base and set it up there. Through that other method. But yes, as for now, this is a part. I'm going to say I hope you have all enjoyed this. Join me on next time where we're going to get, hopefully next part, we'll get the last of those resources all organised. Well, I think it's probably going to take me about a part just to set up more steel production. And yeah. Yeah, that'll be really fun and we'll get into the tier, the next tier of stuff. It's going to be exciting. Hope you've all enjoyed this. So see you all next time. Bye -zy bye.